Hello everyone, we are back with a new lesson. Today, we'll learn about the changes in properties of materials. Let's begin. Classify if the following objects as a solid, liquid, or gas. Popsicle, butter, and ice cubes are solids. Water and orange juice are liquids. The air inside the balloon and the tire are gases. An ice cube is a solid material. What will happen if you place an ice cube on a pan over low heat? Watch the video to find out. <clears throat> Let's analyze. Answer the following questions in your science notebook or journal. What happened to the ice cube after it was heated? Did the ice cube change? What are the changes that happened to the ice cube? What is the state of matter of the ice cube after being heated? An ice cube is solid. When the ice cube was heated, it melted. It turned into water. It changed from solid to liquid. Let's learn more! What will happen to the butter if it is heated? Well, just like the ice cube, the butter will melt. Remember, when solid materials are heated, they change into liquid. The process that the solid materials undergo when being heated is called melting. Examples of solid objects that melt when heated are steel bars, candles, and chocolate bars. Let's learn more. What will happen with water if it is put inside a freezer for a long time? The water in the tray will turn into ice. Prepare melted chocolate or a chocolate bar at room temperature. Put the melted chocolate in the refrigerator. Wait for 10 minutes before checking to see what happened to the melted chocolate. Check the melted chocolate that you place inside the refrigerator. What happened to the melted chocolate? The melted chocolate is starting to solidify. Remember, when liquid materials are cooled, they change into solid. The process that the liquid materials undergo when being cooled is called solidification. Examples of liquid objects that freezes when cooled are oil and ice cream mixture. What happens to the molecules of a solid object when it is heated? The molecules of solid objects are compact. However, when a solid object is heated, the compressed molecules will expand. The molecules move and collide. What happens to the molecules of a liquid object when it is cooled? The molecules of liquid objects are not compact. When a liquid object is cooled, its molecules will move closer together. This is why liquid objects solidify. The molecules stop moving and form a closer bond with each other. Be careful in doing any experiment or activity related to this lesson. Make sure that your parents gave permission for you to do the activity. There should always be an adult present to supervise the activity. Remember, when matter undergoes melting or solidification process, no new substance is formed. Since there is no new substance formed, the changes the matter shows are physical only, thus called physical change. Water that is cooled in the freezer will turn to ice, but when we bring the ice out and heat it, the ice will turn back to water. Melting and solidification are done in different industries. Join us next time for the next lesson. Bye!